She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up to see her She's a Mona Lisa Good morning guys, this is kind of a weird spot to start a vlog, but we checked into the island at the last night around like five o'clock I think. Um, and we are going to be partnering with them this week to take some pictures and just relax. So I want to take you guys along with us and show you all some behind the scenes. Daniel just left to fly the drone. Um, it's supposed to be cloudy today, but no rain or anything. Um, I am going to fix my hair and then I'm going to text him and find out where he is. Doing some beachy curls and though they're probably going to fall out. <laughs> Daniel right here. Hey guys, so I'm with Daniel now. We just finished taking some pictures for um, for my Instagram, but also for the, the blog. for the blog post that I have to do. Um, now I think we're gonna go back to the room unless we can find another spot that we need to photograph. Last time we did like several of these spots, so we feel like we can get it done pretty quick. But I hope I'm not covering up the speaker. So we're gonna go back to the room and edit those, and then hopefully by the time we're done, my mom and stepdad will be ready. They're here too, I didn't mention that. They also came. Back in the room, I am now going to, I changed obviously, fix my hair and makeup again, and then I think we're gonna head out for the day. Hey guys, so I just sat down. Daniel is over in that direction, flying his drone with my stepdad, and I'm just sitting on this couch. Um, I was gonna sit down over there, but I am just like so sensitive to, uh, there's just like so much that's been going on right now with like Kristen, I don't know if you guys follow Kristen's, Kristen and Marcus Johns, um, but they were recently um, hit head on by a car while they were on their bike. And then with Corey LeBerry passing away in a car accident, I just am like, I sat, I sat down on the sidewalk over there and I was like, I am going to go sit somewhere a little bit safer. So yeah, I'm just going to chill here and work on some stuff while they fly the drone. And um, I don't know what we're going to do today. Probably just hang out. On at the beach. So pretty. The are right over there. So close. We're about to leave to go to our friend's house really quick and um, probably get some food. Visiting, I changed earrings, that was cute. We're visiting our friend's house and, excuse me. So we came to visit our friend's house um, and, here I'm gonna point this way. And uh, they're not here right now because they rented out as an Airbnb. I'm gonna give you guys a tour because this is the most beautiful place ever and you can rent it if you want. I'll try and find an Airbnb link. Out of the house, so beautiful. Now we're going inside. There's a hot tub over here. Nice little private hot tub. Excuse me? Yes. Here's when you walk in. How freaking beautiful is this? Perfect kitchen. We're gonna start counting bedrooms. One bedroom. Cutest little bathroom. Another. Oh, sorry. I'm vlogging to show everybody. So this is the first floor. What? Well, no, the second floor, I guess. Little bedroom. Another bedroom. So is that three bedrooms? Four bedrooms. You can go out to the balcony. Another bathroom. This is the top floor. I love this bedroom. This is so beautiful. Glorious. 
a little hangout spot. And another bathroom. So I'm out of breath now. <laughs> um, yeah, this place is gorgeous. It's um, on 30A. No, right? Like, what else do you need to know about a beach house other than how close are we to the beach? That's all I want to know. Dana and I just took some pictures. Um, and Did you show the whole house? Yeah, I did. I gave a little tour. So I'll put the pictures that we took right here. And then if there is a link available, I don't know if they've officially started like um, letting people rent yet. Um, but if I can find a link, I will have one posted um, in the description for you guys. On our last trip here a few months ago, we ate at Buffalo Jack's several times, so we're back. So we just got back to the room after eating. Um, we love that place. We go there. We've gone, we went there last time and we had to go back. So I would definitely check it out if you guys are ever here. Um, we're gonna walk around cause there's still a lot going on. So we don't wanna stay in the room. We're just gonna go explore. It's very dark so you can't see us. But this is on like, I guess, I was patio. I don't know what this is. Um, but they have like music and dancing out there. Um, so we're just walking around enjoying the night. But the, uh, the ocean is right there. That's where we were earlier. And this little spot is really pretty during the day. I'll have to show you all. Um, but you can get married right here, right in between those little trees. They show pictures of ceremonies. And it's so cute if you want a little beachfront wedding. This is one of the pools. And in that big rock right there, you can actually swim up to it, and it's a little bar. In a restaurant. Yeah, in a restaurant. Well, I guess bar. Yeah, same thing. And then there's a cute little food truck over here, and another restaurant over there. Um, what was I gonna say? Oh, it's like almost nine o'clock, so I don't really know what time all the like nightlife activities shut down. But it's just a really fun place. You can pretty much just come and stay here the whole time if you want to. Like, you have options for food and they have um, activities, I think, like five nights a week. But it might be seven. I don't know. I'll check. Um, but they do, like, activities for kids and they have, like, little parties and there's live music. Um, so it's just, like, it would be great for, like, bachelorette parties or bachelor parties. All those kind of fun things or just fun vacay. It is a really great spot and of course you're in Florida and it's beachfront so it's an awesome place to relax and hang out and vacay. And here's the little island grill. So it's another little cutie restaurant and then over there is the other pool. Here's another restaurant. And you're right next door to, um, so that's the pier, but there's also restaurants all there. So if you don't want to eat at the hotel, you can eat at one of those and you can go walk on the pier. We're gonna go get water. Cause last time we, moved, we always sleep with bottles of water. We're gonna have any last night. Hopefully this will. As you can see, I just woke up. Look, look at how beautiful it is outside today. <laughs> yes, guys. Um, so it is Thursday. It's our last day here. Um, Say so I'm actually going to be taking over the island's Instagram. So it's really exciting.
Guys, we are about to walk down to the little shack by the pool um, to look at their breakfast stuff. And I'm gonna show you guys what I was wearing. I got this shirt from Target. And these shorts are actually Levi's. They're the, it's called, they're the Too Faced style, I think, cause it's white and then light denim. Um, and these are from TJ Maxx. You can still purchase them on Levi's website, or at least last time I looked, you can. Um, but of course, like you never know what you're gonna get at TJ Maxx. And then these little sandals are from the brand Cravo. I think that's how you say it. They have a super cute Instagram. morning vlog. I did a pretty bad job vlogging yesterday. I feel like like actually talking. I know I have some clips but it's Friday and we're going home today. Here's the beach. Very beautiful. Um, I'm, It's 6 48 in the morning. Yeah I'm tired. So we'll fill you in on that too. We're leaving. We look good though. Who is that? Excuse me, who are you? <laughs> 